hello uh, in this video we will see how we can install the additional version of php in your class server okay so let's find out how many php version right now the server holding on okay for this we can go to the domain section after that we can choose the domain name in the domain name section you can see uh, it is showing that php settings the version is 10.4 okay if i we click on it and then we can see that we have a, having only two versions of php so we are going to install additional versions of php in our uh, current scenario we are going to install php version 5 on this server so so our php application that was developed on old version of php is able to run on this particular server okay so after uh, installation of the new version of php i mean the old version of php you can see that the version naming will appear here and you can run your application on the old version of php okay so let's mm, check this out I, how we when we can do this okay so first of all we have to log in into this server via the ssh via any software okay after you log in into the server you have to enter these commands line by line one by one okay uh, it's a pretty simple and straightforward process so you don't have to worry about uh, anything okay so i will share all the commands in the comment section we need to run all these commands one by one as you can see we already run all these three commands that is independent of the php version after that we are going to install uh, the php specific version of php by specifying the exact php version here okay so you have to check on this okay uh, as you can see it is asking for some permission maybe we can say yes to it we need to wait for each and every commands to complete its process as you can see this particular version this particular command is already successful and uh, we can now proceed with other commands okay we need to give permission to the appropriate options here uh, you can see uh, we install the php version 5.6 from this particular command and uh, with this command we are installing the uh, useful php extensions for this particular version of php okay as you can see it's successful now we need to install php 5.6 cgi okay as you can see it successfully uh, run without any error okay after that uh, at this stage we have successfully installed the php version 5.6 and its extension and also the cj version of it okay and the last command is this one which register the handle in the class panel so we uh, we can easily change the php version for a particular domain name okay and last we have to hit this particular command 
as you can see uh, we have uh, this particular uh, message that is the new php handler with the id php 5.6 minus sor successfully registered at this point of time we we are able to see the new version of php in the uh, in this uh, class panel if we go to the domain names click on the particular domain we need to change the php version go to the php settings and as you can see previously we are having only two versions of php that is php 7.3 and 7.4 but now we are having the another version of php that is php 5.6 okay so to use this we just need to click on this all right so we can manage the other options of this particular version of php reform here all right so there is nothing more we need to do just it's uh, good to go after that we can simply click on apply as you can see uh, it's successfully updated settings are successfully updated so we can simply go back to the domain section click on the particular domain name and you can see uh, the php version is reflected at this particular option okay we can see the php info page from here as you can see it is successfully installed on our server okay so thank you for watching this video i hope it's it will help you out okay thank you